hello everyone this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com today I'll have another episode of unboxing and review video and I'll be reviewing the Seagate Backup Plus Slim and Portable Plus portable hard drives if this is your first time here a repeat visit thank you for your support on this channel I'm always trying new and different ideas if uh, that is something you're interested in please visit for more if you're only interested in review videos there will be links in the description box below so on my channel I do not provide any affiliated links or take money from anyone so in that way I can give you totally honest and unbiased opinion and uh, I purchased this with my own money so the backup plus slim I have had one in the past and still I have been using that for a few years and I'm going to just you know open this up and see if they're exactly the same and then we'll just like you know try to uh, do backup for the first time and see if it uh, it's uh, it works right way or if it's uh, in a plug and play so this is the backup slim plus and this is the portable and the difference between these two is that you know this is four terabyte and this is two so this is actually good for travel and this is good for like in you know, home backup storage but still you can travel with this but this is a little bit you know heavier than uh, this one so let's uh, open this up very fast and see what we have inside okay so looks like we have some instruction manuals and then and there's the small brochure and they provided some you know software to organize your photos and stuff and here we have the portable drive so let me just put it in here so I'll see if I can open this without cutting it. Usually I don't like this type of packaging uh, made of plastic. Okay, so it looks like you know uh, you can easily open it. So here is the USB cable to connect to your computer or laptop. And this looks like this. So this is the proprietary uh, input for the Seagate because I have the same thing for this one right here and then let's uh, take it out so this is uh, white color or cream color and this is red color so they look very identical I don't see any big differences in them the only thing I can see here is that the light button or the like an you know, operation button right here is kind of a dot and it's kind of a bar right here just a very minor difference and also looks like uh, they changed the logo it is here right now but in this old version it's here so I'll just put it here and let me just you know quickly open the portable plus so it's the same idea uh, same cable and inside you know same this one has slightly different uh, brochure so I'll just set it aside here and also you know looks like the same literature they gave with both of them and a very similar type of packaging so I'll just you know try to open this up you can see that this looks identical to the smaller version they look very identical even the dot for the power or the operation button our operation light is right here similar like this but this is just slightly heavier and this is slightly lighter so they're the same thing but just different you know uh, storage capacity so what I'm going to do I'll just take this from here and we'll try to connect to my computer and see if it works right away uh, and if it's just like you know plug and play you don't have to do anything so let's uh, open the computer so I'll just take it here and you have to just insert this end in here and then you need to insert this into your laptop but for my laptop I need to actually use a dongle so I'm just going to put this in here and now this should go into the USB-C connector to my 
laptop and then it should pick up by itself let's take a look if it does and you can see that you know the light is kind of lit here and I can feel the vibration in it so now you can see that you know it picked up by the computer so it's just going through the scanning and you can see that you know it gave a folder so I'll just you know get rid of these uh, scanning and I'm just uh, I'll just move it a little bit here so I have a file here so let me just open this folder so I'll just transfer this file from here to the Seagate and let's uh, just control C to copy and just here paste and you can see that it's working right away so you don't have to go through anything so just you know plug and play and it's very fast uh, it's uh, done instantly and you can see that you know the file is right here right now which is this file and let me just play here for a second just to see if this is you know file is okay zipper or anywhere and, and you can see that you know it's playing the file which is from my another review you can tell right away that so this is this just works fine and you don't have to go through any other you know setup or settings or anything so I have been using the other version of the Seagate portable hard drive uh, backup plus slim for this one probably for four or five years and I I took this to many countries with me never had any issues and definitely I'm hoping that this is going to give the same service uh, it's not going to give any problem or anything but uh, definitely you know uh, if you are looking for a portable hard drive uh, this is one of one of the many uh, brands or items you can consider and again this is not any uh, this is not an affiliated or paid review so this is a totally honest and unbiased opinion so that's all for Seagate Backup Plus Slim and the Backup Plus Portable Plus that's all for today thank you for watching this video there will be more videos coming up so I'll see you shortly thank you